Welcome to the audiobook version of Forbidden Tech, the complete guide to energy, social, and biological technologies that they did not want you to know about. By Naima Morris and Tavon Rivers. Introduction: Why we wrote this book. Whether you are an engineer, a do-it-yourself enthusiast, scientist, or just your average Jane or Joe, this book was written for you. It does not matter who you are. If you are alive and living on this planet, you are affected by technology. We all use energy every day. We all breathe the chemicals in the air and eat them in our food. We are all part of a society that has been using covert operations on its citizens. It's time for us to wake up and understand what has been going on in our world when it comes to hidden technologies. If more people made the choice to educate themselves on some of these basic fundamentals, then it would be harder for the opposing powers to fool the masses into accepting the state of things in our world. The authors of this book have traveled the world building prototypes for alternative energy devices. During this time, we've met a lot of people and have come up against a lot of opposition. Perhaps the most shocking thing we've encountered was the level of ignorance around the kind of technology that exists in our world today. We wanted to do something to change that. We believe that the best way to help change things in our world is to educate people around the technologies that have been hidden from them. If you try to do research on your own, it can be confusing and overwhelming. There's a lot of disinformation and propaganda on the internet. And sadly, a lot of scams that take advantage of people. The true nuggets of wisdom and facts are very hard to find. We know because we've spent years searching for them. With this book, we've taken everything we've found and compiled it into one basic crash course. We've cut out all the fluff and brought you right to the heart of the matter. While the average person knows about some of the basic forms of energy and technology that is promoted in controlled mainstream outlets, there are so many more areas that remain hidden. Many inventors have been undermined by administrators. Their devices taken in government raids, their lives and their families' lives threatened, and even some attacked, beaten, and killed. Psychological tactics are actively employed on a mass scale to influence the public perception. These tactics infiltrate the human mind and encourage the lowest levels of human behavior, effectively turning us into a weak-willed society of people that police themselves and unwittingly uphold the oppressive structures of corporate domination and control. Some of these hidden technologies are absolutely the most important thing that can be released. A lot of them would end suffering, save lives, and end financial slavery. No one can deny that there is an unspeakable amount of human suffering on this planet. So much of the pain humanity faces has to do with the lack of access to energy. Can you afford to survive? Can you stay warm? Can you get well when you are sick? Can you get food and water? All of this has to do with your ability to access energy. We believe that these technologies have been kept from the public for a reason. Energy is the underpinning of our entire society through our economy. If new energy technology is set free worldwide, the change would be profound. It would affect everybody, and it would be applicable everywhere. Common misconceptions. There are some common misconceptions that you will hear a lot when it comes to some of the topics that we are covering in this book. We would like to take this opportunity now to address them. Misconception: Free energy is impossible because it breaks the first law of thermodynamics, which states energy can neither be created nor destroyed, heat and mechanical work being mutually convertible. This is not correct. The laws of thermodynamics are part of the laws of physics, which are themselves incomplete. Fifty percent of the original theories that created the laws of physics were purposefully redacted from our public knowledge base by the financial interests of J.P. Morgan, Hendrik Lorentz, and Thomas Edison. The missing theories are found in the laws of nature. For which there are several law-breaking examples, such as the flight of the bumblebee. All of this is fully explained in the section of this book, Maxwell's theories redacted.
Misconception. Perpetual motion is impossible. If this were true, then how does the Earth rotate? How do electrons spin around an atom? There are many examples of perpetual motion all around us, yet we are told to believe that this is not possible. We cover this in the Laws of Nature section and also provide many examples throughout of natural energetic phenomenon that can't be explained by the incomplete laws of physics. Misconception. No one has ever successfully demonstrated a device which produces more energy than is fed into it. If anyone ever did, they would instantly be a billionaire. Again, this is not true. There were at least several that were known to demonstrate working free energy devices. There are probably many more that never went public. We cover some of them in this book, including Stanley Mayer, Paul Pantone, Bruce De Palma, and Pons and Flashman. These inventors were ridiculed, threatened, and even murdered in one case. Their inventions were silenced, and they usually were made financially destitute. Misconception. If you believe any of this, you're a crazy tinfoil hat-wearing conspiracy theorist. This is a prime example of social programming. Many conspiracy theories have been recently proven to be conspiracy facts. Nevertheless, most people just disregard many new technologies as conspiracy theories. Governments and energy companies have spent decades and billions of dollars in social engineering programs to influence people. We cover this in our section on JTRIG, Cointel Pro, gang stalking, and electronic harassment. Some of the measures that have been taken are diabolical, to say the least.